So now what happens is you see your worst nightmare in front of you. Now you must make a fortitude save that you get advantage on. A con save. Yes. Fortitude. Sorry, it's using... Why is this from the wrong one? It's using the old phantasmal killer. There we go. I love you, Axel. Um, but I nat 20 So, con save? It would be a 21. PGC. So you should be safe. I like how Axel says should be. Yeah. You're not, but you should be. Yeah. Well, you're safe from this. Let me rephrase that. <laughs> and also, this book needs to link its stuff better. Well, besides that, you are all good. So, with the... Uh... Four. I'm on I'm now. Really. Starting to get filled with water. Uh, Corrin is gonna go up deck and see what the fuck is going on. At which point, you guys are going to finally hit the shore. And I do mean hit because nobody was manning stuff because they were shooting wildly into the water. Oh no! So, oh, because someone screamed shark. E uh, so I feel like this is a reflex save to catch yourself <laughs> when the ship hits the shore. I just really hope I don't go overboard. Sixteen plus my decks of four twenty. Four twenty, you say? Sorry. Oh, I no, nice, nice. Uh, but if you get above basically like a twelve, you should catch yourself. Yeah, oh, no. but I crit failed. <laughs> Oh, yeah, you no, fall down. I, yeah, I got a of five. We're going to say <laughs> that you fall down and land on the shore. <laughs> Just well, fall on... right over the edge and land on the shore. She does. I wasn't exactly on top deck yet. Oh, did you fail top top too? <laughs> yeah. I'm yeah, top. I wasn't on top deck either. I went to go get my well, stuff, remember? I rolled a total of five. I thought you had just been looking in the water. That was me. In which case, then, the time from before where she said she was looking to see in shapes in the water, I don't know how she was doing that. Oh, never mind. Sorry. Yeah, so I'm I'm a little lost. Uh, I mean, what I had did... Okay. Toyo had was trying to see what the heck it was, but since she can only guess what it was, you know, was rip, uh, something large, right? From the ripples, right? Yep. So she just said that, and then the fact that there's a hole in the ship, she's like, yeah, I better go get my stuff. <laughs> it's, I mean, water's gonna flood into the, you know, lower parts, and she wants to go get her stuff, because she doesn't have her backpack on her. Alrighty. In which case, you just fall down, and uh, both of you fall forward and take 1d2 points of damage. 1d2? Yeah. Hey, quick question. What's a D2? It's that. It's also called a coin, in case you didn't know. Hey, all right. <laughs> People <laughs> always try to hit me with that, but I have a three-sided dice. <laughs> and technically a two-sided dice. Here, let me find it. All right, there we go. So what I'm going to do, because I'm lazy, is I'm just going to roll a D4, and if it's a three or a four, I'm just going to divide it by two. All right. Thought you didn't have any D4s. No, but roll 20 does. Roll 20 has a D2 as well. Hey, fair. <laughs> anyway. right, no, not roll 20. D&D &D beyond. Ah, you lame-o. So, yeah, that's that's two points of damage. I there you go. All right, one and two. Because I, I, I rolled a four on the D4. Speaking of... uh, I believe that now... <laughs> Our uh, our other person who is up top is going to be taking a uh, taking a nice roll here to try and save themselves. Oh, I rolled a I rolled a sixteen. Oh no no no, not for that. For for something else. 
You're gonna have to roll four. Oh. For a moment. But anyway, yep. She. I mean, because yeah. the thing. I mean, it's a, an action to probably check the. You know, do the checking. But since she no, has to dip in. I thought because she had a dip in rogue, she can go dash, make a dash downstairs and grab her stuff. You can probably dash down if you know exactly where it's at. I but mean, you still gotta go into your room and grab it and then come back out because it wasn't yeah. a room. I rolled a 16, what do I add? I was double checking this one. Because damn you spells. I believe wisdom and then con. Uh, wisdom. And you said you rolled a 16? Yeah, so I got 16 on my wisdom. All right, you don't have to roll the second one. You don't, you didn't, you don't, you see it, but you, you see your worst fear in front of you, but you instinctively can tell it's not real. Spooky. This is Nightmare Island. So, uh, after Corrin falls down, he's going to get back up and he's going to continue up to the top deck. When he reaches the top deck, he's going to yell out, What the hell is going on? This fucking ship is flooding. Fucking sharks, man. At which point, Catharis is going to be like, I think you just said what the hell is going on. All right. Since you're an idiot, let me rephrase that. <laughs> Why is the ship flooding? Well, so you're so smart, why don't you know? Because I was in my room. Yeah, hey, you're not that smart then, are you? Katharis <laughs> 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 oh, <God. laughs> gives no shits. Katharis <laughs> <laughs> just does not give a fuck. He's literally standing there with like his head, like leaning over the railing as people are just firing cannons. Just like... Man, these guys are dumb. I'm the smartest being in the universe. Can can I produce Flame Carthus? Well, you can, <laughs> but he's going to react like a mad savage. And oh you're going God. to do it on a ship full of wood. Sure. I mean, I'm going to hit the ship. What's the worst that can happen? We are surrounded by water. Gotta go grab Catharsis' page to see what his grapple check's like, because he's gonna throw you in the water. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That's his, that's, that, that would be his number one response. Is he's like, fire! Duck and roll! And he would throw you in. My god. Oh my god. That's a good thing. Toya said, nah, I'm not in the middle of this shit. Oh, man. I'm still looking for fucking sharks. Damn it, Mike. Why are you so useless? <laughs> oh yeah, Mike's like bad, bad. And it, or wait, God damn it, he only has so many words. Stay, die, go, die, enemy, wet. Is an enemy in the water? Enemy wet. You could have. I could have told you that. There's a hole in the boat, Mike. Wet near? Yes. Oh gosh, in the meantime, while they're having this, um, I'm guessing Toy has gotten her stuff after picking herself up, right? She definitely should have her stuff and gotten yeah. herself up. And uh, the water is slowly filling up that level because the level that Mike was hanging on and the level that your room was in should have been on the same level. Mm -hmm. unless, unless you stored your stuff outside of your room. No. Which would be a bad idea, because then you'd have to see if it was still there. I know, that's why I was like, no. Uh, no that's she... Speaking of, I mean, you've landed at the island now, but, yeah. you know, uh, the there is now another hole in the other side of the boat as it rocks, uh, you know, basically back and forth. Yeah, like I said, she is making, trying to make it up those stairs, and just, nope, nope, nope. Uh, and I, I run over to the other side of the boat and I say, these fucking sharks are fast! I don't think it's sharks! You just hear Toya says. They're... I don't think it's I thought sharks. it was a shark. I, I'm pretty sure. I, I thought it was a shark. Katharis looks over and he's like, ha! Shows what you know, it's a dolphin! A dolphin doesn't... A 
dolphin would. Sh- <laughs> but dolphins yeah. are assholes. Dolphins are assholes. Yeah. No. Can I insight check that? Because there's no way in the world that there's a dolphin, not a character. That is an Yes, you may indeed insight check that. Uh, a 13 plus 8. Oh, gosh. Um, I'm laughing my ass off because that was funny. Yeah, 21. It is not. I mean, Catharsis thinks it's a dolphin. Yeah, but it's not. And he don't, but you don't think it's a dolphin, do you? You're just spouting off whatever feels right, aren't you? Kavita just says, you don't think it's a dolphin, do you? You think it is, but you're not even sure yourself, are you? Coming for his fucking life. <laughs> I'm not trying to be a smart ass. <laughs> she does have an 11 as her, as her intelligence. <laughs> She's just having a field day, like, wait a minute, hold the phone. I... Don't think there would be any accounts of, you know, dolphins tearing up someone's ship for any reason. Dolphins are assholes. They're dolphins on steroids. I don't. I mean, think I did dolph- say they weren't dolphins. I didn't say they weren't super dolphins. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what is what is Cathar's response to that statement that um, Toya did? Like, you you're not even sure what it is, do you? So I'm not really sure of anything. See, I knew it. So you're gonna listen to him. <laughs> I mean, I am trustworthy, though. It's true. He I is pretty mean, trustworthy. Super I mean, trustworthy. I'm, I, I, I don't believe it after that. He, <laughs> even he's not sure about the dolphin, if it's a dolphin or if it's a shark. It could be, it could be, it could be anything. Uh, at this point, it has now been enough time, uh, you hear a voice in your head. Ooh, all of us? You. Yeah, all of you. Ooh. Oh. What does it say? It says, uh, greetings, adventurers. Oh. Greetings. Hey. I'm a researcher, you dumbass. Greetings, adventurers and dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> Though we do not speak your language, we appreciate your colloquialisms. <laughs> you okay, who have not what? fled at the sight of your great fear, you may be able to help us. With what? Especially after... Clearly, are you the ones responsible for flooding the ship? Yes. Dick move! It yeah, must no, that... be done. And uh, another hole pops open in the ship. The heck? Could Do I see what made it? Uh, you can try. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna try. Roll that perception, baby. Perception, baby. Is that's a d12? Uh, there's my d20. I was about to say that is not a great perception dice. You're probably not gonna get it with the d12. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm still pretty sure it's sharks. Um, I got a one again. We are not sharks. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you're sharks, though. We are I not know. sharks. Okay, but still, you're not answering it. Of Why is it necessary to pop all in our means of transportation? We cannot tell you unless, yes, you, you, bet- unless you promise to aid us in our quest. What yes, is or whatever. It? Wait a minute. Wait a minute, what the heck do you want us to do? We need your As- assistance in rescuing our comrades from the island. So that, okay. Uh, normally, uh, I mean, we have already were here for something else. Entirely wait, different. Wait, 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 wait. You're telling us you're putting holes in our only means of transportation and leaving this island to save your friends. Yes. Exactly. So- that makes no sense. How does that make any sense? Oh well, no, logically. that's part of uh, that's part of something else, actually. But I mean, you know, if you don't yeah. leave, you can't not help. Yeah, well, sure. Well, well. I didn't want to leave anyways. Well, well there you go. You... Then it shouldn't be a big deal to you. Yeah, but at the same rate, what the heck? Yeah, you can't leave the island. 
so that makes okay. You're making no sense. First of all, you poke a hole in our any chance of means of not. It's not even escape at this point. It's the fact that we're not here bothering you. I mean, you're here, aren't we're you? We're a neutral party in this, and you just po popped our boat so you can ask us for help. Uh, we actually, doing? we popped your boat so you wouldn't leave. No one's allowed to leave. Yeah, well, you know what? You better fix this goddamn boat when we rescue your friends. We can yes, do that. That's it. We can probably do that. We can do other things no, too. No, no. There's, there's no probably. There's a you are going to. Exactly. Mm, I don't and think you have any. Uh, I don't think you have anything to uh, argue with. Um, you want our you service? You'd be surprised when I have to argue with. Go ahead and try it. You want our serv and you want and you want our services. So. I, I mean, we'll just crash the next ship and ask them. You act like you're our first ship. Didn't you see the other ship in the in harbor? I mean, uh, kind of. You guys, kinda... you guys don't speak our language. I mean, no, we speak telepathically. Why would you use language if you had telepathy? Record history. Record events. Well, that's not speaking. Rocks. That's writing. My voice rocks. No, but... Mine's doesn't. It sounds like a gurgling frog. Oh, that's nice to know. But still, you, you destroyed our boat. Yes. Destroyed the, the previous event. I'm guessing you. I'm gonna take a. I'm, t I'm going out of limb here. But um, you also destroyed the previous researcher's boat. Uh, you know, I don't remember his boat, but probably we destroy all mention... the boats that come here. You can't leave. At least not yet. And when she... Toya looks uh, kind of distraught and like, you know, what possessed you to think that is sensible? I, I mean, I don't really question orders. So you're not even the... Oh, you're not the person in charge or the person that's... The uh, only thing you do is do what you're told. Great. Yeah, no, that's pretty much it. Great. So... Is there a boss we can talk to? I mean, he's on the island somewhere. He's one of the ones we're trying to find. Is that the boss we're trying to find, Mike? Is that your boss? Uh, Mike goes, boss, no. Okay. Oh. One second, I need to go look at Mike's goddamn dictionary again. Yeah. Make you look at that thing every two minutes. I know, right? Well, and he only then... has so many damn words. Boss he down. To... Boss, Boss is under the water? Shit, I don't even think he has the word no. Fuck, I don't even have the word yes or no. Alright, bad. No. Oh, bad is no? Good. Okay, okay. Okay. So, your boss is not under the water. Is your boss on the island? Good. And we want to kill him. Good. Cool. All right. Let's do this. And when Julia looks over and just like, sounds kind of mortified, like, I understand this. But you do realize they've also destroyed our means of getting out of here. There. I mean, yeah, that was our big point. Yeah, but at the same token, you do realize this is not an answer to if you're going to ask someone something. I know that I'm not the best. All right, all right. Let's 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 let's, let's get this across. Y you guys request things. We don't request things. Yeah, you guys. We don't. We're not asking for much. We're only asking that you don't d destroy every ship that comes in here. And then yeah, ask no, that's our help. that's our order. Then whoever ordered it is an idiot. Yeah, you you're probably the idiot, but it's all good. <laughs> No, no, the heck we're not. No, yeah. what, what person breaks someone's boat and then asks, demands a favor in, in order to be fixed? When uh, they are I mean, the original. They didn't uh, demand you a favor or break the boat. So your logic is flawed. Which adds <laughs> but, to my argument. But in the same way, Toy is like, you. Okay, how did this <laughs> boat get broken? They broke the boat. Uh, no, we <laughs> broke the boat. He told us to break the boats. And you're Who's going he? to follow it mindlessly. Well, Who's yes, he? that's uh, oh, our boss. Who's your boss? Oh, Johnny. Johnny? Johnny who? 
Johnny Ogaloth. Johnny Ogaloc? I mean, that's about as close as it gets to in your tongue. I mean, a try me, and which Toya is like, well, at least try me on that. You say that I don't understand that language, but can you humor me? What is the language that you speak? Uh, at which like, point, let me double check. Yeah. Oh, wrong manual. Yeah. Up, 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 up. All right, it starts speaking in Infernal. Oh, no, she does not understand jack shit of it. What do what languages do I know? Uh, not Infernal. <laughs> so now not he's that. gonna he's gonna switch up. He's like, well, there's a translation in blah blah blah, and he starts speaking in Abyssal. Uh, no, nope. <laughs> it's nice to know how to. Uh, it, it, this is getting fun. This is playing a goose chase game. Okay, but you, you want us to find your boss. Or what do you want us to do? We want you to go on the island. Okay. Try and find and help any of our friends as well as our boss who would believe are on the island. Okay. And which uh, Toyo looks at Kay like, have you, I mean, are we, we're not even guaranteed they'll fix the ship. You know that, right? But well, what other choice do we have? At this point, I got a smart ideal of... Uh, I got a two-cent of an ideal. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not gonna... Uh, not while these guys are listening. I got a smart ideal. But uh, I'll humor it later. You know we're still listening telepathically, right? Yeah, I'm aware. That's why I said <laughs> I'm not telling you. <laughs> that's why I so probably... Yeah, that's the reason why I didn't say it out loud. They can also probably hear us when we're on the island. Too. I mean, given the fact they want yes. us to search. They say, they say, yes. That's a it's lie. Like, okay, so they can't. <laughs> yeah, no, no, what no, do no, you no, mean? No, no, we no, rolled no. so high on our deception. <laughs> that was, okay, let me inside check that crap. <laughs> inside check that crap. Oh my god. What do you mean? Inside we rolled check. so high on our Yes, we rolled so high. <laughs> okay, 13, 13, five, right, let's, 13. Let's see if uh, let's see how they do. Let's see. I'll I'll roll inside as well. Ooh, I don't think they have any pluses. Let me see. Okay, I rolled a 19. That's without even adding my insight oh, well, of three, so 22. All right, yeah, they're lying. At least they're about at least lying. about that. They're I like that you haven't lying. insight checked anything they've said except for I that. Know, but I'm just just that. I mean. There have been no check. Everyone, that's why I wanted to play a module to see. And I'm like, do I screw them over? Or do I have, do, am I too easy on them? Oh, man, I'm so easy on you. These other DMs would have murdered you by now. I mean, so dumb, guys. Toya did, I mean, Toya is not believing it because what possessed you guys to do this? Uh, we haven't boss. heard anything. Boss told us. Of course. They, they're following orders. If you yeah, want to know more than like, that, you gotta at least agree to try to help us. I'll are agree. We gonna get, okay, but are we gonna get a guarantee that you're going to fix the boat? Alright, I'm gonna be honest here. I don't know if we can actually fix the boat. But we promise so you, not to destroy it when you come back. Insight check that, dang it. <laughs> she's, uh, okay, now she's gonna insight check that. 22? One at twenty. Nah, all right. Yeah, he's like, you, you don't know either way whether he will or not. You do know that he's telling the truth that he can't fix the boat. So you can't fix the boat. You ask for our favor, and then you just but be but you know, after you have destroyed our means. I mean, yeah. Toya is just sighing. The like the sailors are just on the boats, like freaking out. By the way. For those who didn't, you know, since I mean, no one's paying attention to their I mean, I mean, passively, she's not just seeing this shit. No. Uh, yeah, and she's just like, okay. It's like, they were weak. Oh. Okay, I'm, okay. So, what are we looking... What... Your people that you're that are on the island. Yes. What... What were they there looking for? What were they doing on the island? I, uh, I'm not at liberty to discuss that. 
I'm not at liberty to help then. No. Exactly. Have fun in the mystery aisle. No, no, no. We're not have fun in the mystery aisle. If you, I mean, you li- uh, you're already starting off. At which they're flight. just gonna go ahead and poke another hole in the boat. Okay, wait, hold on. <laughs> how 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 do you expect us to be able to help you if we don't know what's on the island? Exactly. And, and, well, you and, haven't even agreed to try and help us, so why would I we tell you? I literally did. I literally did, though. Did, I said, did all of you? Do it. Did all of you? You're going to need all of you. Okay, Dude. But... Except for these sailors. They're pretty useless. At which point, one of them just, like, drops dead. Okay, could you, okay. Could you, uh, could you not do that? Maybe. You're killing people, you're po- a poking hole, and, and, and you're not helping us. You're not at least giving us something to work with here. You're telling I us, love, too, mm-hmm. that they, there's an assumption that there's sand, for one. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody has looked to the <laughs> island to see what the island looks like, what's on the island, where on the island, really, what's going on. Nobody knows shit. Nobody cares. <laughs> <laughs> right now, she's been de- dealing with a disembodied um, head to voice telling them that uh, they need to help them after they have poked shit. <laughs> what does the island look like? What does the island look like? Oh, man, it's like a perception check. <laughs> Hey. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I will give you a reception check. <laughs> it looks a little bit like a perception check. Who would have guessed? Oh god. Oh no. That's a 13, did okay, it? 13. So, let's uh let's give a little bit of context. Uh, you know, as you Look out onto the island as Michael looks out onto the island. Uh, it appears to be a verdant, verdant tropical island. Sandy beach that you're currently on that opens up into grass and shrubs, beyond which seems to spread a jungle uh, with different trees. You know, you can't tell what kind. Uh, well, Jewel can. She sees some banana and coconut trees. Uh, there are gentle breezes blowing here, and the gray fog that had covered the water as you came in seems uh, less oppressive than it does you know it's it's uh it's interesting and which she's like okay are you guys still there i mean uh, mental we're voices here. yeah we're here i mean I mean, the place looks like it's nice. It looks like a tropical getaway. Ah. I mean, they do look like they're not in any danger. Unless I'm missing something and you might want to humor us. I mean, you're all on board then? It depends. I We would like some answers still. Well, I'd I mean, like some assurances. I get tired of telling climb, this tale just I mean, for people to... I mean, I would like some assurance that we're going to be able to go home, too. Keep this can mind. I, can I climb down Corrin's rope and join him on the sand? Yeah. I do that. Okay. I mean, I'm, I mean, you didn't assure us that the boat would be fixed, and heck, it, it wasn't. it's not even going to be. Keep this in mind. Yeah, no, it's not. Probably I not. I know, that's... Yeah, see, that's what I mean. But you're probably not getting out of here, you know, with us out here, even if you find another boat or fix the boat. I mean, even if if both the case happen, can I ask, uh, are we going to be assured to let that boat leave in peace? I mean, I I promise personally that we will not harm you when you leave. Yeah, but uh, any mean, uh, any uh, nor d- indirectly means of. I mean, harm. we will not harm you, personally. Indirectly and directly. Not well, us. I understand. Yeah, not not directly or indirectly. Personally, will we harm you? Okay, that's a little we, bit. Of we will we will take no action ourselves that will bring you unto harm. How is Mike? How is Mike gonna get down? Me. <laughs> Yeah, that was an inside check, and which is a 11. Uh, he beat you this time! <laughs> I know! I'm... He took his 10 and 1. <laughs> He's like, yeah, you know, yeah, no, you're fine. He took his 10. So are, you, uh, <laughs> so are you, uh, so are you willing to, uh, 
at least think of helping us out? Thinking. But it's just that I would, I mean, wait a minute, they got a 10 on theirs? Yeah. Well, they rolled a 10. Oh. I know. Oh, uh, oh, oh, because I had gotten 11 on the insight. Let's see. What is their plus? What What would that be? Deception is intelligence? Uh, deception is um, charisma. Huh, 12. <laughs> I was hoping he was intelligence because he has a plus four to intelligence. No, 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 that was it. That's the charisma. But uh, twelve. So if if it's uh, above twelve, you you know he's lying. Well, not really lying. He's just half truthing. <laughs> I guess you could but, uh, say. But she got an eleven. But she got an eleven. All right. Yeah. I'll so I mean, you, he's still kind of distrustful, but you think for the for the most part, he's probably being somewhat truthful. Is that um, weird? So he looks to this? you and he I'll... says, you know, yeah. oh, go ahead. How about this? Well, well, I'll think about it. I'll think about it. It's not like I'm giving you a flat no, but I am thinking about it. Does that seem like a feasible answer? Yeah, I guess that's fine. Provide, um, like you said, provided, to, uh, provided the um, um, uh, terms we have agreed on. It does not seem fair, rather than a straight no. Mm. I mean, once again, I don't really feel like there's much bearing on either side for argument, but... Uh, no, neither. I mean, you can't necessarily find them. No, but I can just keep waiting. Yeah, but... You'll, you'll die, it. I'll wait, more people will come looking for you. Who said that? You say, assume that there's people looking for me. Well, you guys came looking for someone, so... Uh, not really. It's more partially... It, we're researchers. That's not what these guys are saying. He says, look at the sailor's hands. They're also... They're paid hot hands, too. Yeah, that's, that's why they're more honest than you guys, usually. Oh, jeez, aren't you a delight? Yeah. I just don't care about you guys. You guys are tools for me. Uh, well, let's get this out of the open. Any one of us could probably kill all of you. Yeah, but yet you can't step foot on this island. No, no, no. Don't, don't mistake it. We don't want to step foot on the island. Can't oh, step foot not? on the island? Well, I'd... And why? No. Why not? Good luck figuring that out without our help. No, no. <laughs> uh, no, no, no. You want me to... Uh, well you said, you've me? still, uh, you're still haggling over here, so I'm pretty much done <laughs> haggling. I think we're about to sink your boat and kill everybody on board, so... I mean, I would prefer if you didn't. Well... Just, then, just sink it. Yep. Sink it. Yeah, it's yeah, it about five yeah. seconds. <laughs> And the boat, the, the, the boat sunk. Wait him not to sink the damn boat. The boat sunk, and sink the it. tailor no, no. sailors are currently being ripped to pieces in the water. So, if you're planning on getting off the boat, now would be the time. Ellis wise, yeah. you might be fighting something in the water. Yeah, yeah, she's getting off the boat, but she's just like, can I at least try to persuade you not to break the boat? Uh, you just okay. spent a bunch of time wasting their time. You're gonna have a tough time uh, <laughs> trying to convince them not to just kill you. So, have fun with that. Good job. Nice negotiating. Oh, yep, you dude. negotiated and yourself just, right into death, eat. pretty much. <laughs> so, I would get off okay. the boat and onto land, or I can almost assure you, these things in the water will, tell, will tear you to fucking pieces. Just out of character. These are not right. combat situations. This is a story thread that the, these guys have in here. <laughs> like oh I said, gosh. you'd What's be lucky that? to fight one of these guys. And, 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 and she looks at and he looks at Kate. Okay, which which, at which should have been apparent by the fact that you're not even strong enough to see them. Yeah. I don't see you agree, uh, uh, haggling. I was the only one doing it. Yes, no, and I look mean, where we, it got you. Yeah, we, uh, <laughs> I think we got the reality of the situation we're in. Yep. Oh, uh, really? They're eagerly lying to us, and no one's questioning it. Uh, yeah, we but we don't see we couldn't we don't have a choice but not to question it, you know. Yeah, it's like you're you're you coming. To, it was the same with Michael. It's like you're coming to a bargain with nothing to bargain with. You yeah, we're that, coming. Do you remember? Also, Toya has the sending stone. 
Uh, it's, <sighs> I don't think she that's going to make much of a difference to any of those uh, guys. She can pretty much send a message to don't send a, another ship here. It's de deadly, uh, but it's a death trap. Oh, man. Have you tried the Sending Stone since you got here? Uh, no. No, you haven't. Oh, yeah. Suspicions, suspicions about what that water did. Uh, do, you remember when they, do you remember when they said they sent that guy with the Sending Stone? Which is why they didn't no, they... care about giving you one? And they absolutely said that? No, they did not say that they gave him the uh, Sending Stone. Yeah, they did, but okay. No, you didn't. Absolutely in the first one, no. but whatever you want to Mom think. Mom and Dad, stop fighting! No, because right. I remember this conversation <laughs> is like, <laughs> wait a minute, that's why stop. I... I... Just stop. <laughs> What was said in the first part of this, when you asked about the Sending Stone, was highly sarcastic from the Mage Order. Oh, why so, didn't we think of that? Yeah, sorry, Jewel, you're just kind of wrong on this one, but it's fine. Okay, I, okay. Said, and immediately after they said that, why didn't we send that? Because we fucking did, which was my immediate next words from the Mage Order after that. To make fun of you for that fact. Jewel, we Which still is, love you. Yep, but once again, uh, I have the recordings. I can go pull it up right now if you'd like. I have no, no problem no, doing I, it. I just spent no. today editing them. That's how I know I said it. Because I just edited those episodes today. Jewel, we still love you. That's how I know what was going on in the last one. It's... Yeah, we're, we kind of showed up to a gunfight with, like, broken no, arms. you guys were adamant on keep sailing through the weird-looking water. That's also true. That's around. absolutely also true. No one wanted to take a closer look at the water. Jewel makes a very good point. No one, and when... Or, or the it, island, like, no, but no you one. also went back down and stopped looking as well, which is why we just skipped five of the squares to the thing, so... Yeah, you know, one time is fine. Okay, no one's gonna, uh, no one's taking agreeing whether or, or arguing. Right, so her. then she just stops entirely, which fine, but I mean, she had the option I mean, of five whole squares. Where I even stopped a whole round, and I was like, "Does anybody want to do anything as we're approaching the island? Look at the thing. Look at the boat. Look at anything." <laughs> I asked. I stopped and asked specifically if anybody if, else if I, wanted to do anything. Okay, so that would have been the time. Okay, to... okay, but you say that like as if okay, okay. Toy is gonna convince the captain, you don't, the crew. You the don't case, need to spend but... that time convincing it when you can still collect information. You just went back downstairs and ignored what you thought was a problem. Yeah, because it's a pointless argument. Which is fine. Yeah, this was fine. But that means that you had the option to do more about it and did not. And what could she have done? No, humor me. No, I'm all for it. Oh, man, you could me. have done any number of things. You could have sank the ship if you really felt that strongly about it, dropped the anchor, could have charmed the captain, used any number of spells on some of the crew. God forbid there was any number of things you could do in an open world, but go ahead and act like you were limited to do nothing. It's all good. I'm not going to. I'm not going to. Uh, no, <laughs> I'm no, because I'm the other that. two people on my team didn't want to do what I wanted to do. I can't I'm not, do it's anything. Not that, it's not that. It's just that I don't want to sit here and argue like this. This is an argument. Right, which you keep starting. You said, we're, we're already past this. They're on the shore, Jewel. They're on the shore. If you can't see where the problem in the equation is here, I invite you to take a second and look. Because I'm not trying to get an argument going. I'm trying to move this story along. Which I've been trying to do, and I always try to do. Because that's my job as the DM. But we still love you. So if you'd like, you can stay on the ship. You can get on the shore. Either way, I'm going to continue the adventure forward of in the way that it would logically go. Of course. So currently, the ship is sinking. Those two are on shore. And those two, the two, three of the water have stopped talking with you as they are currently ripping sailors apart. Of course. Mm. 
So I think our sailors are dead. No, no. Yeah, you had 20 of those. What a waste. And, well, only, only one thing to do now, let's go into the island. I'm not gonna, well, I mean, she's on the beach. I mean, I mean go in, like. Is in, she? In, I in, haven't in. actually heard that. I've been waiting for that statement. She's on the island. Okay. Just sitting down and just saying, you know what? I mean, this is nice the rest of my life. Yep. So you guys are still at the shore then? Is that what I'm hearing? Uh, we should head inland. Oh, what? that's up to you. I'm just going to go ahead and make a roll to the GM real quick. Let's see. How many soldiers do we have? 20. Okay. That makes sense. So I don't think I don't think we should stay here. We should probably head inland. In, I inland. We want to go check out that other ship and see if it's completely unusable. I'm uh, kind honestly ninety percent surprised that Michael hasn't just dipped into the forest at this point. <laughs> He's been waiting on shore forever. I mean, we can check it out when we come back. I if we come back, it. I would rather check immediately because, I mean, how hard is it to pilot a ship? But I mean, Honestly, like, after I jumped on shore, I was about to just ditch all y'alls and go into the fucking forest. Have fun. Um, the I don't recommend that because we have no way to get to the other ship. I mean, technically, I you mean... could swim two hundred <laughs> feet offshore. I yeah. mean, wait we, a minute. Where is the sh uh, where is the um, ship? A right uh, hundred feet offshore. Yep. Oh, uh, it's, it's. I mean, we could, but if you'll direct your gaze a little bit into the water, you'll see all the blood there. This is where I just need sound effects of screaming. Just play. <laughs> oh, my balls! Great. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Um, so the best, I think the best option is probably to just start poking around the forest here. So I, I start to head that way. Sort of slowly waiting for them to follow me. <laughs> uh, I follow the putty tat. <laughs> Catharis just, you see, shoot out of the water at high speeds and smash into a rock. That's gonna hurt my clavicle. You okay, bud? I don't know what the hell is in there, but it did not like the taste of me. It spat me right out. Oh, great. I think it's because I took Hashtag a bath. Plot armor. <laughs> yeah, that's that's probably it. It's probably the bath. Hashtag. Do you want to come with us? Yeah. That sounds okay, like a let's... good idea. Although we Let's should, go. Although we should probably find a ship to get the fuck out of here at some point. Just saying. We'll do that later. Just saying. That'll be, that'll be a future ass problem. All right. Well, you tell future me that I told him that we should have thought of this, because I'll forget. Okay, I will. You will what? Uh, never mind. Cool. Cool. Hey, does anyone else oh. know where we're at? I can't remember where I am for some reason in my head heads. We're on an island. Amazing. Amazing. Yeah. Where we, where we going? Um, into the forest. Very cool. Very cool. Yeah. Yeah. Is that a forest? And he just points at the ocean. I mean, you're fully welcome to go back in there, but I wouldn't recommend it. I was in there? But I don't even know how to climb a tree. Right. At which point I just sort of walk a little further ahead and try to look into the forest. Do I see anything in the forest? 
Uh, not. You see tons of trees. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck out of trees. The trees everywhere. No. I'm glad Valios isn't here. That'd be a hell of a time. Oh no, Bob! Or Mike! Mike was his name! Yeah, you probably should figure out where Mike is. Where's Mike? I mean, that was your assistant. Oh, it was my friend. At which point you just see a block just like roll itself out of the fucking water. <gasps> Mike! Yeah. Hi! Oh, fun! Okay. So Mike can come up with me. And he can help me perception check in this forest, right? Good. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's gonna help me perception check. <sighs> Seven plus six is 13. Do I see anything suspicious? Do I see any traps? So you don't see any traps. Uh, you just see what seems to be a regular forest, you know, tropical forest environment. Uh, sorry, let's double check in on some of the stuff that's going on on the side there. And you look good. Yeah, yeah you, you seem like there's nothing really to, to go on. It does seem like this... Uh, Island is not all that big. Like the, the the island's representation here on the map is way bigger than it actually is. Oh. Okay. Uh, hmm. Do either of you two researchers know what it is we're looking for? Porn history check to see if you actually remember. <laughs> he does not fucking remember. That was a two. Bundle. Oh, no. Well then, what were we here for again? <laughs> hmm. Um, voices. Do you? Are you still here, voices? Are you guys near the shore? Uh, I'm kind of like. In like a little bit more inland, trying to look into the. Uh, um... How far inland are you? Uh, probably at the near the forest edge, but probably about ten ish feet back from the forest edge. All right, you should still be within range. Uh, also. I don't know what you're using your crit for, Jewel, but I hope um, it's fun. It was for the memory of... It, she knows you remember what the heck... But yeah, you I'm remember guessing. it all. <laughs> you yeah. remember You remember the time you were born as a small child and had yeah, to... Yeah, you remember birth. Just <laughs> unnaturally <laughs> memorific. You oh. remember... But anyway, she remembers what the heck they were there for. All right, cool. Uh, the thing speaks out. You... Sup. Hey. Hey. Um, did you like the sailors? Did they taste good? Eh, I really ate them more out of duty than hunger. Fair. I get that. Uh, what are we looking for? Okay, so, are you gonna help? I mean, yeah. Alright, eh, well, this is my last chance to talk to you, so I'll probably tell you anyway. Because if you come back here without my friends, I'm just going to eat you anyway, probably. Maybe. I don't know. Can you eat us if we're on the shore? No. Okay. That's good to know. I mean, I'm no no reason for I it. I can still kill you up know. there, though. Yeah, fair. Well, for a little ways. So, here's the deal. Mm -hmm. I need you to go look for some Yugoloths. Do you know Yugoloth? what a Yugoloth is? Oh. Do I know... Do I know what a Yugoloth is? Yeah. Yeah, I do know. Do you really? No. Yeah, I didn't think so. Alright, they're like a <sighs> demon. Alright? Okay. I mean, do you need more than that? I mean, like, some information would be helpful. Okay, well, I don't know what you all know. 
I mean, I kind of do, but only if you're thinking it right now. Meanwhile, um, Toya just like, yeah, so you want us to find a demon that's on this island. Is there a reason why he was trapped on this island? Yes. Which was? I'm not high enough on a pay grade to know that. Inside check that. In the meantime, uh, Kay thinks about luxury what? cheeses. Um, 12? Ooh, good. Uh, isn't that 12 plus 8? Oh, no, that is with your plus 8. Uh, let's see. Oh. Ha-ha! He is telling the truth. <laughs> Uh, um, yes, we keep, we beat the insight. So you go off, uh, yeah, for that one he did. Oh, I forgot I accidentally GM rolled that. I thought I public rolled that. Good job, me. Can can I do a roll to see if I know about you, Goloths? Yeah, it's a religion roll. Sweet. Give me that fucking roll. That's a 22. Hey, oh, so you Goloths, uh often called daemons, are neutral evil fiends. Uh, I'm, I'm going to ask the voices what we're looking for is a lesser or greater you. Says combination. Some lesser, some greater. Okay, One so or multiple. Lesser and greater Yugoloths. Do these Yugoloths have names? Uh, these ones do. Give me a moment. Bonk. Oop. Ah, yes. There we go. So you have Yolgash. You have Demo, which is like Demon, but without the N. And uh, there's some more, but he says only one other named one matters to come home, and that's uh, Kagaha. <laughs> the character in the other in the other one? No, that's Kagaha. Oh, forgive me. Yeah, forgive me. Glaga. Yeah, I got my hair a little convent co confused. It's, it's easy to do. Yeah. I have one more question about these Yugoloths. No. Yes. What type of Yugoloths are they? Ah, yes. That's always the question. And it's the more important one because that one tells you what they look like. Yeah. It's kind of important. It is. So, we have Yolgash. He is an Arcana Loth. Okay, so that that's one of the greater Yugoloths. Yes. These these are comprised of one greater and uh, two lessers. Then you have Demo, who is a Morayanoloth. Okay. And then finally you have uh, the Yagnoloth, who is Karara. Filthy Karara. So, let me get this straight. You destroyed our ship because... You can't find this, and I can see why not. Oh, no, no, no. We destroyed your ship for a whole different reason. Oh, really? Yeah. What? Uh, so this island is super fucked up. Really? Yeah. Couldn't tell. So, uh, for one, it's made out of dead bodies. Oh, I kind of figured. I mean, the water that you're sitting in is used in the rest, you know. Yeah, this is actually my home turf down here, almost. This is, uh, this is water from the River Styx. Why does that not surprise me? Yeah, me neither. But, uh, in addition to that, you know, we have, uh, we have some other bad things. So the island is made of dead people, but that's not the worst part. Oh, goody. Yeah. See, it doesn't look like it's made of dead people, does it? No. no. Yeah, that's because there is a curse on this island. Cool. Oh, color me pink. Yes, the your your buddy over there, 
the uh, he kind of like mentally somehow prods you towards Mike, at which Mike goes Mike. Mike is one of his words. Yeah. Radical. I picked the right name. Yeah, but it's not like you think. It's not Mike with a K. Oh, it's Mike with a C. Yeah. Oh, is it Mike with a Q? No, it was Aww. Mike with a C. Mike with a Q would have been better though. Yeah. That's how his name is spelled. <laughs> um, but he says, yeah, the, the, there is a curse on this island uh, that was brought here by your friendly little construct friends over here. Not, oh, you're a good guy, Mike. Well, not him specifically. Oh, oh right. well, then, Mike, I'm sorry for blaming. Mike. So I wait, pat him. Wait, Click. so let me get this straight. Um, uh, this island is compressed. Of, I mean, I could have, I'm not surprised. I would either have guessed either, you know, people being buried in the water or, you know, probably the island itself. After sea, you know, the water does give some telltale signs. So there's, but, uh, there's, there are a couple more things. So the, the curse, well, how do I say this? Telepathically. Well, yes. Da-dum-tch. Have you worked hey, in comedy? you want to type out the names of those Yugoloths real quick? Yeah, I actually already have them typed out for my notes. So I can Good. put them down here for you. Because yeah. um, I'm making a note of my character. On a different note, um, did that twenty and did that twenty-five give me anything from the inside check? Uh, so far he seems to be hundred percent up front. In which he kind of says, hmm, this is for once. Uh, Why didn't you address this the first time? Well, I'm not gonna lie, if we tell people, they usually just leave. I mean, yeah. I, don't think it, yeah. I mean, partially, do you blame them? I mean, no, no, but that's why we wrecked the ship first, so then they can't just leave. Bargaining I mean, tools. I mean, think about this. If they're ill qualified and downright terrified of it, I mean, that, it definitely means that they... It's not that they I mean, let's put it this. They're a little bit on the weak will side, and the ideal of doing such a thing... Yeah, or, but if they're weak, then they're just food. They're no use to us. But that's a very narrow... Broad, don't you think they already have enough on their, you know? Mm, maybe. I mean, it, I mean, don't you think they have enough things to deal with? And trust me... So, uh, I mean, anyway, the curse, you know, the curse turns you into a block. Well, like blocks. Makes you all fuzzy. It's weird. It's really weird, and it takes time, and it, and it's, it's scary, and it changes your mind into a uniform piece of the collective. At least that's what we think. They join the hive mind? Something like that. We won't go on the damn island. Fuck that noise. There. I mean, we do so... if we absolutely have to, but yeah, otherwise, yeah, we're not trying to turn into blocks. We think so let me get this... that that might be what happened to our other people. They're blocks? <laughs> I would like to at least point out, let's do at least a dirty 20 for that insight on that curse thing and the whole block thing. I mean, it seems pretty legit. So you want people to do something that you possibly aren't sure how long a we might turn into blocks before we find your friend that's what happened to the last people we sent at least that's yeah. what we assume either that or they died you think you guys I'm are the starvation. first people we've asked to do this i mean there was this I'm one guy who came here a couple of weeks back yeah funny dude yeah because he was a researcher he yeah that's what he was... said yes and he wasn't lying. Oh, well. That makes more sense now, seeing as how he had a bunch of research equipment and stuff. Yes. Did you eat him, too? Mm, I don't think so. I think he took the deal. They usually take the deal. Yeah. Yeah, but if you they are researchers, what did you think he, he was meant to fight? Well, I mean, he can research. He'll figure out what the problem is. Apparently not. Apparently not. If he's not, no one has heard a hide hair of him. 
Well, you know, we don't always have the best judgment. I mean, I would question it if you, you're going to, uh, I mean, I'm not here to pick signs. But if he's a researcher, and he had papers on him that clearly indicate he's a researcher, that may give you an insight that he may be telling the truth. I mean, it might have. But, you know, once again, if he wasn't strong enough to do it, he was just food, so. Jeez. Y you know, you will eat any scholar, anyone that literally counts as quote-unquote weak. I mean, anyone who can't get done what we need to get done, yes. Don't think that's a little messed up. Mm, not according to my theology. But In fact, it's heavily Corrin. encouraged. Kay is just watching Corin do this. All right. Boop, boop, boop. At least can you humor us of how long does it take so we at least know what our timer is? Um, because clearly we're here. Well, we would only spend less than an hour on the island at a time to try to prevent oh, yeah. such a thing. But, uh, you know, I think we've seen things last a little while. We don't know the exact time that it takes. We do know that it's a progression, that there are stages. Okay. What if, okay. And what about, okay, is there stages? Do you at least get an idea of what the stages are like? Well, there are two different types. Some people have it in the mind and not the body, and some people have it in the body and not the mind. Well... When they have the body, they start looking like blocks. Slowly at first, small block, large, small blocks, and then larger blocks until finally they just, they look like they're made of blocks. Do any of us look like we're made of block? No. What about mind first? The, the mental mind. is a little more difficult to distinguish. They begin to act irregular. Define irregular. Hmm. Well... It would depend. Sometimes they would have a distaste for curved items or become obsessed with logic. Other times they became obsessed with money. It seemed obsession was the main point of their fanaticism once they had lost their mind. At which point Michael's thing goes off. Is my jug okay? And with yeah, and with um, Toya kind of looks around and saying, "What the heck?" Oh, give me a moment. Because I believe that was actually supposed to be whispered to me, not you know. Oh, is it? Yeah. <laughs> Said it really wouldn't, because it just happens around you. It's not like it's just for you. You're dispelling that. I mean. That that is the case, but they don't know what I was doing. I mean, I was watching you. Yeah, you were watching me, but you don't know what I was doing. You just saw a flash of light. I mean, you would saw True. a flash of light and then a bunch of stuff disappearing. What'd you do? Yeah. Well, as you can see from what the GM said, <laughs> natural <sighs> force is revealed is now revealed for what the horrors actually are. Gross. Yeah. Yes, right. and so, uh, <laughs> give me a minute. Basically, I gotta get down to this stupid thing. Eh, eh, go down. And the surface, bodies, no. Come on, go up. Go up. Oh, yeah, that one. We're in a flesh prison. Okay, maybe I have to go back up to that, I guess. Okay, so uh, what you see is that, though it may not always uh, coincide, that uh, the ground is littered with dead bodies, some of them piled upwards of 30 feet, and... Uh, 
you uh, see that though they are bodies, they seem to be made of squares, almost like they're pixelated. My god, we're in Minecraft. Oh no. Dun dun dun! <laughs> in which uh, Toyo is de definitely unnerved. See, this is the kind of sh this is the reason why I became a ranger. Partially that is also another reason, but this is not the time for that. So. Creepy. Okay. Um. So, we're just looking for your buddies then. Well, that's uh, that's what I want from you. That's for sure. Uh, they came yeah. on, you know, quite a quite a bit ago. You know, maybe a couple weeks now. Uh, which isn't uncommon. We we spend lots of times in different places. Uh, we had a strike team, a full strike team. So there's those three, and then several others who I don't care about personally. At which point, one of the other voices says, "But what about Gogalong? No one cares about Gogalong." Okay, can I just ask a question? You said keep addressing that yourself, and I'm guessing this is a group effort of saving someone's ship. Yes. What about the uh, the rest of the group? What about because, those two? Yeah. Um. What do they want? To clearly, so we don't have. No ah, they want the same thing I want. Isn't that right, Bob? I mean, I also want a raise. Fuck you, Bob. You don't deserve a raise. I mean, I don't have the. I mean, I could have the money, but I don't know if you. Well, we're paid in souls, so. Um. No. Yeah, it's a pretty steep price. That's why we don't get a raise yeah, that no, often. No. Yeah, but no, yeah, the strike great. team came ashore. These guys were supposed to be on the strike team, but someone got land sick. I can't handle <laughs> the stability. Uh, they took some magic items up with them. And, uh, you know, if you guys happen to find those and the people aren't attached to them, you can keep them. Oh, that's lovely. Yes. But uh, that's hard. that's the basic. Oh, and also the water. You know, uh, for those of you guys who don't know about our home turf, the Styx water is amazing stuff. It uh, it gets rid of all curses and diseases and and magic effects, and it also might rob you of your memories and some mental stats. But it does cure the pixel curse. Oh, I told you that was gonna come in handy. Mm, I yeah, mean, it, it also causes major mental damage but it does cure the pixel and which oh. that's like okay it seems like they can take some mental damage yeah. rude and Toya just looks at uh, at him and uh, Corin is like that is rude to say that statement assuming I'll be that I don't right have back any. sorry guys continue to talk amongst yourself she kind of looks at it, looks at Jacor and is like, "That's a bit rude to say that." I actually like my intelligence. Corin shrugs. I mean, that's a bit rude to assume that I would like the ideal of chugging that just to, you know, prolong it. If it well, is a solution that isn't guaranteed, I mean, it's not indefinite. Yeah, tell me something. Tell me something. Which do you like better? On like an either or kind of deal here, um, having a little less intelligence or being dead. That is a valid point, but at the same rate, intelligence. You know, I like my intelligence. I mean, you it's like not, it more than being uh, I mean, alive. But I like the little intelligence I have. Well, you know. I'll let you turn into a pixel block then. When you're dead and whatnot, you can yell at me from the grave and I'll just tell you, well, you should have taken the water. Yeah. Because if you're worried about your intelligence, when you get back to the main island, you just go and see a fucking cleric and the cleric will be like, that's a restoration. You say that, and, and then what are you then? Doesn't matter what I am. Yes, it does, because you just did something that revealed that. Yeah, and? Yeah, it does matter, because we are going to need to, uh, quote-unquote, work together if we're going to get off the bloody condemned place, because 
Cheese guys. He kind of points towards the water, like begrudgingly. Don't blame yeah, us. Yeah, but that's like a future ass problem. We could also die. You say future like as if oh, that's gonna be easy to deal with. No, it's not just, well, you know these guys will just wait till another set of adventurers or researchers come along and then call it a day. That's, that's if we die. And if we die, I'm not going to really worry about it. Yeah, it, you worry, don't worry about it. I, I like living. Yeah, but if we just stop living, we won't know to care. I mean, yeah. honestly, I could live here. Honestly speaking... So, uh, you, I mean, you were technically, and she looks at uh, Kay, you were technically stowed away on the ship. No, I did not. I came here completely, completely up and up. You know that was a deception check against at, her. At this point, Corrin is going to grab both her hands and put his mark next to yours to see if it resonates. I pull away. Well, uh, obviously you pulled away, so there's something you're hiding, meaning you are still away. I just don't want you, like, grabbing up on me! You can steal from me! My deception check is, um... 24! You believe me! Okay. Yeah. With a 19. <laughs> but at the same rate, after the fact that he pulled your hand and the thing doesn't glow... I pulled away. Really? And which, uh, Toya kind of goes over to where Cord is. I'll kindly show you mine. And she does, you know, address where hers is. As, and it glows, probably? Yeah, that's what it does. It glows. Yeah. yeah. At this point, at this point, Kay knows she's fucked. So she says, so she says, well, obviously mine would do that, too. But you just don't go grabbing on people. What? I mean, it was an innocent just grabbing someone's hand. It's not like we're sitting here to try to frisk you. Yeah, it's not like I'm trying to molest you or something. <laughs> oh lord! You can never be now? too careful. You can never be too careful. I fold my I fold my arms <laughs> so that my my hand is covered. You can never be too careful. You never know these kind of sailor types. I mean, we're researchers. I can promise you, I'm not a sailor. As well as I'm not a sailor. You just hear the voices in the water. We're sailors. You're all dead. Shut up. Technically, well. Catharsis is just like, they're not sailors, they're swimmers. Exactly. I fucking hate that. (laughs) I will take that. I will take that pun. (laughs) The the part is he's actually right for once. (laughs) Yeah, no, and that's that's why I find it hilarious. (laughs) Because it's like, no, that's accurate. But, um, so, so, the, listen, it's, it's, it's of that's our okay. best interest. So, you obviously don't have a mark, and if you do have a mark, it's not the real mark, otherwise you would have not naturally pulled away when I grabbed your hand to confirm if the mark was real. I- I've lived in many a place where if a stranger were to grab you, you would pull away. Okay, it's one it's thing that he's pulling, uh, you say this like as if he's pulling, you know, somewhere else, but he pulled your hand. Re- okay, another thing, I am not like a certain person in the world who has a motto that is not a very good motto and should never be you. Was that my motto? Because I was just... <laughs> I don't know. Is your motto grab him by the pussy? Uh, <laughs> that was my old motto until someone stole it and made it unusable. Excuse me. I am I am a cat, so anything you grab me by would be grabbing me by the pussy. <laughs> I like how this is all because it all because of Tilly. Done great. Um. Oh my gosh, Julia has made it better, and I love it. it. Uh, uh, And Julia's just like, yeah, but in this instance, he's grabbing your hand. Still, honestly, we're arguing semantics here. I wanted to dance with you. I mean, you ask, and in most cultures, it is polite to grab someone's hand and kiss it. Not in my no. culture. 
Have you never met another tabaxi? No. Then I yeah. have dogs just go around and sniff the other's ass. <laughs> You're thinking of dogs. You're thinking of the dog people in the south. We're tabaxi. We're more dignified than that. Aren't they the same though? Oh boy. You know what? I'm just gonna. Oh, anyway. oh my god! Anyway, um. Incredibly rude! <laughs> oh my That's my fun. nickname in some places. <laughs> At which point so, the guys in the water are just like, so are you guys gonna, like, head inland, or...? Yes, that is what we're doing right now. And I walk in towards are land. Are gonna die and shut up? <laughs> Eventually. Probably. <laughs> Let's do it quicker. We don't need more voices. <laughs> yeah, I have enough of those. If I really, really want to agitate people, I could do, I could do a full-on encore. But it's just boring. And she's not lying on that. <laughs> so, out right. of curiosity, Axel, you said that it dispelled all magic on a basic cosmic level. Yes. So, does that mean that her, uh, her, uh, water thing is no longer magical? Uh, I think it's only temporary when it's used on items, but I'll have to double check. My, my jug? Yeah. If you were within 10 feet of him. I was. I was right over his shoulder. <gasps> See, and this is... Sorry, not sorry. And meanwhile, Toya is glad you were not near him. <laughs> You're yelling at the waves. I am not... Oh gosh, don't make me make that joke. Dang it. I am... <laughs> I am not... I am not... I am the sand. Poseidon quivered to me! <laughs> Fuck up! <laughs> Thank you! Thank you for making me feel like that actually was valid! <laughs> I will take it! I will take that one. I will take that. I'm sorry, but I, I will take that humor. Uh, that was a great I didn't look at this. I should have looked yeah. more closely at this. You have to pick a object, magical effect, or one creature within range. So we're just going to assume you were trying to dispel the curse. But yeah, it's not an AoE spell. That's magic, anti-magic field does that. Oh yeah, that's what you were thinking of. So. Yeah. Yeah. Although yours, yours would do the effect within range. It's just, it only Which has range a range. Is 120 feet. No, that's it's the range of casting, not the range of effect. Yeah. <laughs> you. Thank you. No, I was not trying to do that on purpose. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Because I actually sneezed. Ew. Ew. <laughs> okay, now that was... Yeah. So it's only a magical effect within range. It doesn't undo all effects in that range. Mm -hmm. So her, uh, her jug is fine. My spear is fine. I didn't which say I'm that. Is... <laughs> no, I'm, I'm just kidding. Sure it this is. spell will get rid of the plus two effect. Uh, I mean, it would if it were actually aimed at it, I think. But it's it has to be aimed at a particular creature, yeah. object, or effect. So. Uh... So basically, my object was the island. Yeah. That we were. That or the effect of the curse, which would have been there, but it only actually gets rid of about 10 feet's worth. At least according to the book. The so what you're saying is, is that, is that that 10 feet of area that I'm currently standing in is no longer cursed? Yes, for now. Oh. So it's not only the sticks water. No, the six water just has the effect of getting rid of magical curse properties, etc. Which you guys can see if you look really closely at the edge of the island. Where the water laps against the shore. Oh. Which is probably a not pretty image to look at. If... No, no, it's not. If the you're ducks... not looking at, like, passively? 
Did you see that? That's why you wanted us to look at the island. Yeah, I get it now. Do, 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 do. You know, looking and, and paying attention to your surroundings can provide, especially on campaigns that I haven't designed, will provide tons of clues about your surroundings. As well would, as sometimes the, uh, you know. I would like to take a look at the trees and see if there's anything interesting in the trees. That's a good idea. I don't see anything with a six. Well, it'd be a 12 total. No, probably not. I mean... Alrighty, since this island is officially just a pile of skeletons, it begs the question now. Um, would the um, nat uh, natural explorer be valid if you picked forest? Sorry, one more time. The natural explorer. Um, would it be, you know... It, would the benefits be are still valid? No, it would not, because technically that is an illusion of a forest. It's not an actual forest. Uh, yep. Oh, great. So are the, are the trees corpses? <laughs> yes. Gross. Yeah, the Gross. trees are made of bodies. Everything's made of bodies. Gross. But they're cubed bodies. Oh, great. Oh, okay. huh. Uh, you just hear it's like okay I can see um, the remote where, I'm not, where I get this stupid yeah um I turn to Mike and I say Mike do you know a way to go and and she but before she does that completely walks up with the rest of the group and she kind of looks back at the um, water and says, yeah, you guys better at least honor this bloody thing if we all die. Or at least come damn close to it as we come back with your friends. Well, they will or they won't. Pretty much. They I would really prefer if they did. I mean, Same. Let's say we do. Yes. That's what we're gonna hey. go with. Yes. Yes. Okay. It was you didn't answer it. You just said, "Let's say you do," and then just said, "Yes." Did we? <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh. Yes, you just did. Well, then yes. <laughs> yes. So you, in hypothetical, you hypothetically will honor it. What will happen? Well, we won't kill you. I think that sense. That's about all we got. Fair enough. I mean, not just that, but, um, I mean, it's it's a bit far ways off to go swimming all the way back to shore the other way direction. Yeah, we don't have a boat. Can you kind of nudge that other boat a little closer here? Very gently. Don't break it or anything. Uh, just kind of nudge would, it. But it's absolutely sunken. It's, it's oh. like, yeah, it's not like a, yeah, it's not like it's a working it's boat. Sunk. Great. Mm. You sunk it. I, did, I told you we sunk all the boats. Didn't oh, we say well. that? I was pretty sure we yeah, said we yeah, sunk all the boats. I don't know. I know that, but it's just like you can just uh, make it just in people, you know, scream terror off the boat and then just left the boat in the direction uh, in the state like a stasis of it can be used. Yeah, but no, that right. wasn't our orders. Our orders was keep anything that goes to that island from leaving the island by any means, which is usually destroy the boat. Boy, oh boy, you guys. So, even if we do get your buddies, we're still really screwed, because we don't have a means to get it back home. No, I mean, swim? Make a boat? Maybe there's a boat somewhere here. Oh, great. Fucked. You, <laughs> yeah, but that's a problem for, for future us. That Can I look for a boat? You guys have lots of problems. Can I look for a boat? I mean, you can. But I wouldn't put Corn. it in the water right now. <laughs> it's a Corn. 16 perception. Let's see. Meanwhile, uh, Toyo's just... Oh. Great. Now I'm starting to think I should have 
stayed at shore and just stayed listening to the lady talk. A t lady talking about him. <laughs> you mean the lady talking about frogs? Exactly, and including the fact that she gave her a frog too. You still have that frog? Yes. Probably even maybe eating on the rations or something. <laughs> I like the joke. This is getting out of hand. <laughs> oh god, this is great. Yeah, yes, I do. I'm starting to think the whole stories about frogs would have been nice. At least a little bit. Yeah, actually, now I think about it, I got a quick question for you, lovely. And she kind of struggles to find a nice compliment without to say a flat up thinking and calling them straight up, you know. Got a quick question for you guys. Um, you do you guys have any idea about the storm that's you know hitting the whole area that is making it hard to have ship travel? Oh yeah, it follows this island. Yeah. Do you know why? Since you guys have been here for a bit. Mm, nah, it's been doing that since before we got here, unfortunately. Insight check that. I would insight check that because you can't tell me they have not done it at 13. Axel? Sorry, one more time. Uh, 13 on the insight check to see if they actually do not know anything. Oh shit! Yeah, no, they don't know nothing. <laughs> I did roll. I rolled a crit fail, but it's still they don't know anything. So you have no idea, and you believe it's just this island being. Uh, oh, I mean, it's, it's probably it's something on this island, but this island is weird. I mean, you saw the curse. Oh, not only that, but shoot! If it has a a storm following it, that's great. I mean, that is part of the reason why people are kind of coming here for a bit. Because it's been stuck for three weeks. Yeah, I mean, it's a long time, but... We don't really also, if this, if this island is movable, like it moves, why can't we just like use that as a boat to get back to the mainland? I mean, we'll be squares by the time that happens. Oh, yeah. I follow Corin and look around. Well, at least if you can humor us any more information whenever you can. Um. Other than fun, trivial, uh, tall tales? Which mm, are mm, 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 mm. You know, I don't really have that many. Uh, yeah, no, we don't know much. We've just been here waiting. That was our job. We can't leave, and we can't, can't go, leave. and we don't want to go in. Ships. Yep. Jeez. We keep anything from leaving here and spreading the infection. Leaving, but yet coming, too. Well, if they come in, they can leave. Your a, a, a philosophy is flawed. I mean, someone comes in here, gets you know, catches hell. Well, yes, because they came that's here. That's them being stupid. And if they came here, they could be infected, so they can't leave. Oh, great. Field deal. Until we have to go ahead from our boss. I'm starting to think your boss is um, a questionable individual. Ah, I mean... Not in our line of work, he's not. Of course not. Not in your line, but in my point of view, an outside perspective, it is most backwards. Because this is already a weird way of asking people something, introducing yourselves to. I mean, I mean, think about it. I mean, you guys have seemed like you have enough common sense to not do something stupid. 
Well, or, uh... We, or introduce yourselves like that. I mean, seriously. We do our jobs. We are yeah, soldiers. Yeah, but... Yeah, but... Same right, do you understand? Like I said, it is not very polite to just introduce yourself by sh crashing someone's ship. Yeah, that's uh, that's how we were told to take care of the ships. Yeah, yeah I'm guessing politeness is it in your own. What does that taste like? Never mind. You guys don't know what polite uh, manners is, apparently. What does that taste like? I'm going. Does it taste uh, like politeness? Do they taste it like? Does. Do they taste like marrow? You know, it does. You know, it's that's my favorite one. flavor is baby marrow. I just want you to know that. Yeah, no. And Toya just <laughs> group, but she's just like, you know what? I might as well have been. Uh, I might as well have stayed. I need to go look at this. You know, Toya's just done All for today. Right. Just like, ah, I can't believe it. It's not even proper etiquette. I mean, I get that customs are differ, but shoot, just sit there and. So, a 20 foot sphere of fog uh, heavily obscures and surrounds you. Who does. Uh, who? What? Uh, Toyo. Oh. I thought she was moving with the group. Like, she thought that they How were. How are you people. moving with the group and talking with them at the same time? Yeah, because their telepathic bond only reaches, like, ten feet or so. So, like, I've, I'm, I'm obviously there. missing some information in some of these times where, like, there's assumed going with the groups or something, because I got two heads from them that were both walking into the jungle and, like, searching, and then from you all I got was talking to the talking to yeah. the dudes in the water. In which she kind of gave up after they don't understand what the heck is a proper etiquette. <laughs> or... <laughs> Proper etiquette. I thought the group had went into the forest. But... Well, yeah, yeah. they did, and you stayed and stalk talked to those things. That's what we're saying. Is yeah. like you've been sitting there talking to them for however many minutes. Well, the they didn't wait for you. They went off into the forest. So. All right. Okay. I mean, how far, hard is it to find them survival wise? I guess that would be didn't go your far role. in. Yeah, I, I, I mean, it's been maybe in. a minute, so they've maybe got. I don't know what's. I'm not 15, telling you any of that. I'm not. I, I'm not. I'm not even making these yep. rolls up. Uh, that's a twenty-two. Yep. So I mean, you're able to find them, and you'll have to catch up with them, which will either take a couple turns or a sprint action. It's a sprint because it's a bonus action for me. All righty. So, you guys are moving inland. You guys currently, we'll say I'm going to put a shape on here so we get the real shape of what the island is. Da, 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 da. Boop. It's a square. It's My a god, square. it's Minecraft for real. I know, right? It's a square island. And you guys are technically on the south side of it. So, you guys are going inland, I assume, from yeah. from there? Yeah. Okay, give me just a moment, because I actually have to, like, look at where exactly everyone is. So, uh, you said you had looked around earlier, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Sorry, I got this message... Uh, what was your role again when you searched? I don't know. Can I roll again? Sure. Okay. Oh, I was surely worse. Um, 11 plus perception of 6, so that is 17. Alright, we're actually going to have you guys right there. So you see, maybe, and that's the thing, I should make this... Alright, so for intensive purposes, this square is 50 foot blocks now. Okay.
da, 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 da. Why does it only do that like that? That's so stupid. Only lets you tag if there's... Or it doesn't even what the fuck. That's one thing I don't like about Roll20's message system. It's a little freaky. Mm. And with that, you should see probably 50 or 60 feet to the left with your vision of great visioning vision. Uh, what looks like a little river. Ooh, a little river? Yeah. Is it like water river? Is it is it black water? Yeah, it's black water. Cool. I no longer would like to go in the water. So uh, I go near the water. Um. So is the water? Or does the water look? Uh, can I follow the? Can I follow along the river in the way? against where it's flowing does that make sense yeah you're gonna go try to follow to its source go upstream yeah, yeah go upstream and are you doing that from your current position or from where the river is at which i guess i could draw a river real quick um let me keep about a 10 foot distance from the water okay so you're headed that way yeah is there anything else you'd like to do but while you do I'd like to look around. Okay. Around the area. Right. To see if there's any dangers. <clears throat> uh yeah, there's some trees. There's some trees. There's water right there. I nice rolled a one. Trees, huh? I like nice trees. Yeah. I like nice yeah, trees yeah, yeah. a lot. I there's a bug flying around. I'm really interested in that bug. I'm gonna catch it. Because I rolled a perception of one. <laughs> okay. Let's see what. Um, fourteen. What does? Oh. Your perception was fourteen. Mm hmm. Because the six plus the and then she has an eight. Okay. And what are you looking for in specific? I'm just looking around. Let's see if there's any dangers or anything. Yeah. Mm. So just staying I mean, staying aware then? Yeah, pretty much. So, uh, let's see, actually. I mean, I can use my passive for that. You absolutely can. That's the nice thing about a passive. Mm -hmm. Huh, interesting. All right, uh, <clears throat> so what I need is for every, oh no, for one person to roll a d6. Dibs. Six. I got a six. Yep, I'm just checking the result. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Oh no. 
This is the second time I'm going to kill our party. No, you're fine. I was just checking some stuff. I mean, it wouldn't be the first, and it seems like this is starting to get a recurring madness that I'm slowly questioning. Why? I am fair, chaotic this... stupid in real life. <laughs> to be fair, this one I didn't write. <laughs> I'm just following the book on this one. I know, but it just but it seems like, I mean, I, I don't think she was, it was not even, it wasn't even her, you know, it was not a custom module. It was the same thing. In, in my life. The phrase, do whatever stupid thing that makes you feel alive, is quite applicable. So, first things first, and I just had to double check all that. Uh, all of the ground is difficult terrain. Great. Awesome. Yep. So, you basically, um, uh, I believe that's half movement speed, but I could be incorrect. Um, if you guys are, if, if it's... Does the whole ranger thing apply? Um, no, because you're not on no. an actual forest. I know. I know, but the part that says difficult terrain doesn't slow your parties. Um, that might actually still apply. And does the fact that I'm a cat do anything? Don't think so. I don't think the cat thing does anything. I'm trying to look, but I don't see any see anything that would help. I mean... Said... I don't see any reason that it shouldn't apply. So your technique should allow everyone to make regular movement. Which is only going to actually increase the effects of these. Aha! I mean, no longer so affects you are my movement. The, uh, you are following the river, correct? From what I am hearing? Yes, going upriver. Alrighty. So as you ascend upriver, whatever you may call it, the direction you may go, uh, you see just a few feet from the river's edge, maybe 150 or so feet inland, uh, there lies a simple wooden boat that fits up to six people. Oh. A long wooden boating pole lies nearby. I would like yeah, to investigate it. All right. Would you like to make a roll for that? I'm, no, I think I would like to take a success. Mm, I mean, I would too, <laughs> but... Uh, um, did you um, take that success or did you... Did you botch it? Uh, I think I'm going to use luck. Okay, go for it. <laughs> I'm more... Okay, hungry. that's better. That's a 19 plus... Um, what did I say it would be? Investigate? I think so, that's what you were Man, why didn't I say perception? That's better. Uh, 23? Uh, okay, so the boat uh, looks like it's in fine condition and seaworthy, though it smells very strongly like the sea did. Uh, you know, looking at it, what you thought looked kind of like natural boating lines are actually countless names carved into the boat's plank surface. Hmm. Oh boy. What's the n name is about? You know what? I don't actually want to know. There, see, future us have already solved this problem. Uh, wait, we've already solved this problem for future us. Here's a boat. We'll just remember it's here and come back for it. Uh, I mean, it's a boat right here inland. Mm hmm. It can she investigate this thing too? Cause she Figure out like why it's here. Exactly, because I mean this thing looks. I'm guessing it looks in very nice condition, right? Uh, I mean, kinda. It's in decentish condition. Looks a little old, but I mean, it looks pretty good. Looks workable. But also at the same rate, it's inland and not. I mean, also I'm curious about the names kind of scratched onto it. Okay, so what would you like to do? First of all, um, you know, investigate it, because she honestly does want to check out it, uh, see, examine it. Examine, you know. Okay. I'm not trying to be funny, but it's just like, oh. And 11 is a wonderful number. It's a boat. <laughs> it's a 
It's a weird <laughs> boat. I'm starting to get confused. <laughs> It is not a plane. That's like, I know. At least it was a. <laughs> and it put the names on it. And she would like to see what those names say. Ah. Alrighty. Because I mean, as creepy as it is, I mean, it could be worse. So one of them says, Dumamir Stormback, Wollaham Heavy Belt, Miladomir, Zovar, Dobro Demir. You've got Kakis, Taheri, <laughs> Menteri, Kafaris, Kakis, Harasaba. Okay. You've got Demo, Oktbot, Gongbold, Botkan. Can you I get this name? Because she's going to technically take a part. And, and, and oh, yeah, you better be writing them down then. You got a big list here, man. Oh, no. Oh, no. I mean, once yeah, again, again, all of the natural lines in the ship are made of this. Yeah. I guess I can get that, like, list, uh, like, um, either DM to me or, um,. Uh, I mean, if you want the whole list, it's uh, several hundred names long. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay, no, 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 no. <laughs> Said once Stop again, it. there are names inscribed everywhere that would look like a natural line on a boat. Yeah, as much as I would love to write all these down so it can, you know, commemorate it probably to a memorial where they're probably fall they're fallen. At which fallen. Uh, point... <laughs> Unless I've missed something differently, the let me check these passives. Da, 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 da. Oh, that's a pain in the ass. It's not just up here. There it is. Yep, that's pretty high. This one's definitely not there. Oh, great. I can go back to that. That's what I thought, and that one. All right, so seeing as it was done, uh, you know, your companion steps backwards and disappears into the wild. Dun, dun, what? Dun. What? What? Where? What? Our other companion? Yeah, Mike Corn. just goes, Mike. Corn, damn it! <laughs> At okay. which point, Catharis, you just hear yelling from somewhere in the forest, Where the f am I? How did uh, I get lost? Alright. Okay, uh, we'll see about this later. Um, Speaking anyways. of, I think it's, yep, it is now 9 o'clock. So it's probably, 11, my time. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. It is probably roughly time for people to start wrapping it up. For this session, at least. It's a good ending spot. So we turn around and one of our companions is just gone. Gone. Great. That's Everyone great. make up and roll, Nusk. <laughs> I mean, I could do one, one last good roll. <laughs> My dice have been rolling like shit. Ah, it's been, been fine. Mine's have been nice to me. I rolled in one three separate times. And I nat 20 how many times? Like three or four today, I think. <laughs> okay, this is a great start. But yes, we are on the island. You finally made it. Ship is sunk. You got a new dinghy. <laughs> yeah. Frankly, frankly, we should have it be like go to the island. Like, not to the island, you know, but the beach. There it is. We know where it is. We'll keep it there. Yeah, but you, you say this, the island moves. Who's to say the island itself doesn't move? 
<laughs> yeah, you know what? That's actually fair. That's actually fair. But I don't want to drag it up onto the shore because I don't want to get near the water. I'm not saying putting it ten feet near the water, but you know, at least out of their range, about like, and uh, like twenty feet away from the water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll go grab the pole. You go grab the boat and just drag it up onto the water or off the water. Yeah, that sounds about right. Let's see if this actually works. <laughs> oh gosh, one final freaking roll for tonight. <laughs> Jewel just punched the boat boat further off into the ocean and we lose the boat. Uh, there's a 12 plus whatever it would be. And just like that, Corrin was gone. <laughs> and then just like yep. that, monsters appear. Oh god. Everywhere, the whole island over. I, I swear to gosh, if this island ends up being mostly undead, I swear to gosh, Otoyo will have like a field day. This one's an interesting one. Oh, also, just so you guys know, and so that there's no confusion, it's officially been 20 minutes or so since you got on the island. Oh, no. Counting okay. from the time you hit it with your ship. Oh, no. Okay. Just letting you know. Yeah. Mm. So what were those things, now that we're out of the game, what were the things that were attacking the boat? What are they called? They're called Hydroloths. Hydroloths? Yep. They have invisibility at will. I think it's Hydroloth. What is it called again? Yeah, that would be that would be what you're thinking of. Hydroloth. Yeah. Figured it was. Hydroloth right. inhibited river of sticks looks large frog like monsters, sometimes compared to Slotty or Hezrus in appearance, and had wing like flaps connecting their arms to their legs. Hydroloths could swim in lava as well as river sticks without losing their memories. And that makes sense, because Phantasm Killer actually. Oh. Never mind. Not gonna later. Yep, it said the Phantasm Killer one. I was thinking of using Steel Memory on you guys. But it had a whole different set of things. It has an intelligence roll and then a charisma roll or something. It's had some things. But it's literally, they put three of them at the edge of the uh, water in this one for whatever reason. Mm -hmm. My guess is as a, uh, a means, most campaigns have them. You have something to keep you from just piecing out of a campaign. There's other stuff in this one, but... And these guys had a very specific set of actions to take, too, like a set of instructions where they're like, all right, if they if the player does this, they do this. If the player does this, they do this. What was going to happen... Okay, out of character, what was going to happen if someone actually did have the soldier background? Uh, the soldier background give, gave you control over the sailors. So whoever had the soldier background, the soldiers on the crew would listen to you over the other people. Oh. Uh, but no. Yeah. Like I said, they have a lot. <laughs> there's a lot of little things that get added into these kind of things that make the additional details worth checking out. So, like, there was another one about the approach. Oh, uh, there were a couple things actually about the water. You guys just didn't roll high enough. I want to know about the water. Yeah, the water had some like a couple of them that were level twenty five rolls basically. Oof. So, you, so you had to have proficiency basically in that uh in right, that please. area, which weren't. It wasn't like they were difficult. It was like arcana and religion or something or the two areas mm -hmm. but you also have to be searching for specific things so you know if you're just perceptioning or investigating then you know you can go on to other things but once again some of them are really high so for instance the one where you were got the smell from the ship mm -hmm. 20 was the one to get the smell and understand where it came from or whatever but 25 actually would have told you it smelled like the river sticks oh yeah 
How would I know what the river Styx smells like? That would be part of your arcana and, and thing training. Hey, you, fair. You would never have smelled it. You just would know that it's supposed to smell like these three items, which was cinnamon, mineral waters, and tar. Oh, okay. That's, that's That makes sense. Yep. Which makes sense why there was the, the religion check. Yep. Like I said, they that's pretty decently thought out one. Uh... And there is a couple of other little things, like the Modron was another big one where he's actually uh, part of the thing. And I said the only thing I missed during the first one that I didn't mention was that bounty thing. That was the only part I missed because I read over it, I guess. Which makes sense because this is like a, let's see, how many pages is this little book thing? 48, yeah, it's a 48 page module. So it's not the biggest module, but it's not the smallest module. A bounty, or the person, the person we're going in to find, your that you guys are going in to find for dead or alive. Oh. <laughs> I like how I your character there. your character rolled a twenty on remembering it, but you did not remember Joel. <laughs> <laughs> I know that's what I was like. You know what? I'm just gonna le let that be a thing. Let her remember it and just said okay. Does he know? Always, because it's, it's she always remembers an option. It. It's always she an option remembers it. to let your characters remember. Uh, I mean, because then the DM has to definitely remember it. Yep, even if it means scrolling back through hours of footage. God, I hate scrolling through footage. I'm sorry, <laughs> but it just let it happen. Well, I just have to do it to edit for the fucking YouTube channel to make sure it's not, like, fucking broken or some shit. Wait, did I... Give me a new thing. That as well as I think we have had our oh, sense of humor moments that got freaking hilarious. It was an interesting one for sure. This one, these ones rough me up because unlike my custom modules, I can't necessarily on the fly them as much because mm. they they have preset kind of mechanics and stuff that work together. Mm -hmm. So like I can't really change the curse or the sticks water because they work in tandem in the adventure. Yeah. But at the same time, there's a lot of things in it that are a little harsh because it's obviously even though it's a wizard's endorsed module, it's still just a module. Right. But I'm just saying it's gonna be funny if we end up running into it. Yeah, a bunch of undead is gonna be funny. I'm actually interested on how this one's gonna go because there's a lot going on at this place. Yeah. And you guys rolled what I consider the most interesting option when when we did that six sided die roll. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Yeah. So we'll see how it goes. I I once again I didn't make this. This is all whoever designed the module. That was their decision to put it on a six a d six die roll and. Let her rip, so we'll see how it goes. I mean, I'm curious of what the six is gonna get me. I'll get us. Well, we got a five, so it'll be interesting. Yeah. Wait a minute. No, the six. second the second time was a six. The first time was a five. Yeah, it was that you're thinking of a different role. I'm talking about the role yeah. when we were first approaching the island. Oh. Eh. Those other D6 rolls were something else. And I'm still sure. Oh, I don't know if I. Did I make everyone D6 or just one person D6 for that? Just one. Just uh, me. Oh, well. I'll do it right next time. <laughs> uh oh. Well, uh, wait, no. On the, on the one when we got on land, not on the original one. So the one when we got on land, did everyone roll that D6? No. Nope. Just uh -oh. one person. Mm. Yeah, I think I called Dib. No worries. I'll do it right next time. <laughs> it should it doesn't really make a big difference is the good part is the thing. So No, that went honestly <laughs>